Hey folks, it's Frithgar here, how you doing? Welcome back to Two Point Hospital. Like that. We can put a correcting pool down there in that corner. Oh! <laughs> oh, this is going to be brilliant. This is going to be absolutely... Look at that. You know this is... <laughs> this, this is going to be fantastic. Oh, this is going to be amazing. How does this work? Where where are we going to put this? Right, we we'll put that one there. We got a we got a console in here as well. That one's going to go over there somewhere. Um, we'll put a toxic waste bin. This this, this is going to be awesome. It's going to be absolutely fantastic. This is going to be the best one yet. Oh, this is going to be amazing. Right, uh, let's drop down the extinguisher. Let's get the air conditioning in here. Come on, hurry up. We we, we got some pool to play. I was expecting, I was expecting like a swimming pool, like the, um, the room for treating like the Pinocchio type people. Um, I definitely wasn't expecting this. Oh, this is going to be incredible. Uh, let's put the clock on the wall over here. Right there, before we take out, be be before we give the nurse who gets to run this room their big break. You see what I did there? Yeah, you see what I did there? I'm not even sorry. <laughs> oh, look, it's got the chalk and everything. This is amazing. <laughs> I love it. This is incredible. Right, come on. As we near the final chapter of today's play, it's time for Sir Nigel's Player of the Day. Today, that honor goes to Mortimer Pickles. His team would have not had the requisite number of players without him. And didn't he do it with characteristic grace and flair? It's a pleasure to see Pickles at the height of his powers. And today was certainly a day where that can be said to have been true. Right, he stopped talking. Here we go. <laughs> that was brilliant. Oh, that was amazing. We've we, we got to watch that again. That was a failed treatment. He knocked his head off and put a new one on. And it still said failed treatment. I am bitterly disappointed by that. Staff promote. He's ready for promotion. We'll have to give him some more training. We'll promote him and give him some more training. And we've got another doctor over here who's also ready for a bit of um, promotion. So you, as soon as you've got the next dude in here, we'll knock the next one's head off as well. Staff promotion right there. Another doctor. Promote. Health inspector is visiting the staff room. Patients remaining four. Come on, I had someone here. Weren't they ready? Ah, there they are. There they are. There's, 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 there's the next one. As soon as they've gone through, we'll, we'll get the next training course underway. Go on. There we go. Up on there. And boom! <laughs> oh, that's fantastic. Yes, and they were cured as well. Right, that's good. That is fantastic. Okay, GP is still going over there. So we don't want to change anything there for a minute. Um, I've got that. I want four GPs overall. Nobody new at the moment. Uh, not going to worry about research in here at the moment either. So we're going to leave that. I will go and have a look at my... Well, what, how are we doing? How are we doing with our staff? Doctors in here. I got you. You need to be trained. And then I got your training level two. You're ready for training level three in psychiatry, which would be quite helpful. And... You... I'm going to wait until it's the pound is leveled before I train both of those in GP level 2. Still thinking of getting rid of you, but I suppose we could hang on to you for a minute. We'll hang, we'll, we'll hang on to her until we get a better member of staff available here for the, um, the higher option. So there's nobody here at the minute. New applicant in two days. Let's kickstart that one again. There. Um, see, the, these are no good. None of these are any good for me. They don't benefit me at all. So as soon as this one is finished, you're getting treatment level two over here. And if I've got another, I don't know if I've got a nurse that needs treatment level two. Inspection report, Mr. Jobsworth sent us a report with his recent visit. It's 30 pages, we haven't read it, but the conclusion reads incredibly mediocre. Great. That's just wonderful, isn't it? We've got several staff now who have training slots. Our money is getting low. Go on, finish that one up. And Training course complete. Class dismissed. Class dismissed. Okay. 
seven trainees currently available. I've got one doctor there. I'm going to leave that one until I've got another one. You were level three, potentially. It's you here, though, that I really want. And I'm going to give you level two on there. Trainers available. Courses available first. We want treatment level two in here. I've only got an outside trainer to do that one. So that is going to cost me 20,000 smackaroos to do that. So if you can quickly run through there. We shouldn't have anybody else needing treatment in the auto queue just for a minute. So we don't need to worry about that. I could get a um, research doctor in here. There we go. Wave five. Right. Manual stations, people. Manual stations. We've got 30 people. There'll be 15 on each of our assistants right here. They will process them pretty quickly. We've got four, five, six. A whole load of snooker cues coming in. Snooker balls coming in. Hopefully, the 22 days that it takes to train this dude for the next level on there, he will be able to do a better job in there. We've got diagnostics nurses. I need better diagnostics, don't I? And we're now minus 22. Gerald Muesli. What do you want? Hospital attractiveness of 70%. I don't know what it is at the moment. Uh, 64%. Well, we better do that. Get a level 5. I didn't actually do that, did I? So, um, yeah, that's still on my to-do list. We've got two doctors. There's the third doctor running in. We've got electrical storms on the way just to complicate matters even further. You are very quickly working through this. We've got diagnostics going strong in here. I've got treatment there. I haven't got any diagnostics over here. Do I need more diagnostics nurses? Let's just check what we've got for a second. Nurses. Who have I got? I got one. I got two. Is that all I... No, I got three. I've got three diagnostics nurses. I need one of them trained in level two diagnostics. And I need you trained in level 2 on here for the ward. Might need to do outside training for a lot of these. It might be better. Are you all ready for promotion? Ooh. Promote. That means that the GPs are We're ready. We're sorry for the litter that you dropped on our floor. That means I've got two GPs that are ready for, treat for training. Course treatment 2 is now done. All right. Go here. There we go. That's the one that I want right there. Dr. Victor Biscotti is on a break at the moment. So I could train him up. The I don't want to train the assistants just yet. It's the two doctors there. I'd like to train GP level two. That's taking a bit of time out in the middle of doing the wave. I mean, it might be all right. And then I've got you here. I'm actually thinking that I will go with that one. Because that's going to boost both. Excuse me. Um, that's going to boost everything. Uh, estimated duration is still currently unknown. There we go. 29 days. Right. We'll do that one. We'll take 29 days out to do ward management level 2 on here. And psychiatry is currently waiting. We may need a second psychiatrist office at this rate. Staff promotion. There we go. Nurse needed in ward. That's going to be more diagnostics training that we'll be able to run down there. Um, we'll deal with that in a minute. So we, we are going to need a ward nurse in a minute. We've got 20 days and we'll be able to do something in there. So it won't take too long and then we will be able to work through that. Hospital attractiveness of 64%. I'm minus 30 grand at the moment. I'm hoping that's going to change fairly soon. It's going to sort of tick back down. Because we've got all of these people rushing around. I've got nobody. The assistants aren't doing anything. So we could train them up. If I've got training slots for both of them. That, that, a lot of patients are queuing outside rooms that are run by nurses. But there aren't any available. They're queuing outside that room. So not lots, but that one. And I need to get my nurses with diagnostics trained up a little bit better. I've got their... Animal magnetism. He's just been cured. There's nearly 9,000. Class dismissed. We got the ward management course has now been completed. So got me two GPs. I, I, I want to keep the GPs going for a little bit longer. Uh, Victor Biscotti. Have I got both of my assistants? I've only got one assistant that's ready for training at the moment. Junior nurse, your treatment. And you are diagnostic. 
Let's go with the treatment nurse, I think. Take you. Courses available, injection administration or treatment. I'm going to go with basic treatment because then that does everything. And then trainers available. I've got my doctor is busy. So I'll take the nurse over here. Now, have I got anybody else that I want to train in this? No, I definitely don't. Right, start training. So I've got there, I've got treatment for a nurse coming in. I I wanted diagnostics, but I actually like to wait until one of them levels up a, a little bit more. Imminent. All right, let's go and have a look at this one. I'm hoping that we're going to get some of these. We, we, we ain't going to get the no deaths one. So same again, rising star, employer of the year, best teaching hospital. We're not prestigious or anything like that. Um, and we're not debt free, so I don't know if there's any like anything related to being debt free there. Let's restart that one. I got nine thousand on here. We got money coming in from these doctors here. See, we've got relatively low numbers queuing outside these doctors' offices now. So once that course is finished, so I've still got twenty-four patients remaining on there. Buddy smug, uh, but buddy struggler. A regionally specific form of avian turmoil, sufferers start by dressing flamboyantly, moving on to clothes laced with feathers and eventually to fully fledged bird suits. It requires treatment before they attempt to fly from great height or sit on some eggs. We'll send, for pa we'll send a patient for treatment in our pharmacy. There is a queue in psychiatry. Now what I'm thinking is we need to remove diagnostics from psychiatry and that would... Lower that down quite a bit. See, everybody's coming over here. Take diagnosis off of there. Right. They're now going elsewhere. We've only got four people. So they'll only come into psychiatry now for treatment. And they will go elsewhere for diagnosis. Which, diagnosis can include this room over here. We can include the ward. I'm quite happy to include the ward for diagnosis. And I'm also wondering if we should allow... Oh, there we go. What have I got in here, trainees? I'm going to go with the two doctors now. We will train the two doctors. So we go into here and we will go general practice level two. Trainers available. I've got two other doctors. So you're 130%, you're 110. So I'm going to go there. It's going to take 34 days to do that course. So I've still got one doctor left over here, and the other three are going to go and second themselves into that room over there just for a little while. Stab promotion. That's good. Nurses are being promoted. And we've got some seismic activity on the way. I'm now up to 34,000. Doctor needed in GP's office. And somebody died over there. That's not very good. Right, your site. So I need a... Earthquake warning. That isn't your medication. Earthquake, that's not your medication. Now then, do I bring in a research doctor? I've got a pure research doctor lined up there, ready to go. Also, Ace Tension here. He has a weak bladder, but we could have a backup psychiatrist. That could be useful. Um, I'm going to pass on that for a minute. We're not going to get anybody extra. We'll, we'll, we'll run it like we got it. We'll, we'll run it like we got it at the moment. Just as we are right now. We've got a few people queuing up on this one. Not very many. And then we've got various treatments over here. Although, getting another nurse in the ward would be good. Because then I can have two of them in there. Kind of like that idea. Right, let's hire you. You're a ward manager from this point on. I'm going to go into there. I'm going to go to staff. I'm going to go there like that, and you, the new nurse, like this, there, and then do that all the way up there. So I've got two treatment, I've got three diagnostics at the moment, and I need to train. Both of those are now ready for training in diagnostics level two, which is going to take all of my diagnostics nurses out of the equation just for a little bit, but I'm okay with that. And then I also want... Um, another nurse trained in here. But what I can do over here is call to mend easy scan. this. We'll keep that, but I will allow extra staff in here. So I've got an optional additional member of staff 
in the ward for when it gets really busy. I've always said electricity was a bad thing. To all those who scoffed at me, spare the thought for the poor souls in a hospital currently under siege from an electrical storm. Yeah, we'll be fine. Don't worry about us. We'll be absolutely fine. So there we've got diagnostic uh, treatment is busy working over there. I got 36,000 currently. Uh, I got 11 patients remaining. This course here is just about finished, so We're I've got to choose. For the litter that you dropped on our floor. General practice two is now done. So do I train psychiatry three? With our dude in psychiatry, or do I do the diagnostics? I'm going to do the diagnostics too, I think. I also want the ward management. That one's quite important. But I think we'll go diagnostics too. We get that one in right now, and, and both of these nurses will go for that one. And you will do that one. Start training there. So there's two more members of staff will be hit all at once. So I've got plenty of GPs training now. complete. Class dismissed. Uh, plenty of GPs, and I've also got the GPs with um, GP level 2 training, which is also quite useful. And we're going to have diagnostics level 2 on several nurses. It's the ward management one that we want. I got you over here. I'm keeping an eye on you. You've got treatment level 2 right here, and we'll keep working on treatment on the doctor. And bring that one up to treatment level 3 as soon as we can. I mean, if you click on him... I love this thing. I love it. Look at Boom! <laughs> and you look at that right there. As soon as it says it's done... There, it, it clicks on round a little bit. So I think he's getting like 10, maybe 20 XP for each one of those that he does. Seems to work reasonably well. It's quite effective, that little bit of treatment. What have we got down here? DNA lab, false tan. Mutation characterized by lurid tinging of the skin, caused by malevolent practices, archaic rituals, or potent cosmetic sprays. The body needs to be purged of this deceptive abnormality before the heart shrivels and darkens to a roasted orange hue. <laughs> the patient is seeking treatment. We'll need a DNA lab. Get him to wait. Earn 100,000. Accept. Right, I need a DNA lab. I'm going to need some money for this. So we're going to go to loans. I'm going to repay that loan. I'm going to take that loan out. It gives me 70000 And then I'm going to go over here, and we're going to build our DNA lab down this side. So I'm going to move that fire extinguisher and stick it over on that side. I'm going to move that aircon unit, and I'm going to put it over there like that. And then I'm going to go to rooms in here. I'm also going to need to hire a doctor that can work the DNA lab. How big is this got to be? A 3 by 4 Right, that one can go right there, and the door can go on here, and then the helixer will go there like that. And then we will do the usual. We'll run through. We'll put that one in. We'll put a fire extinguisher in. We'll put some nice smelling hand sanitizer. We'll put an air conditioning unit sort of more towards the middle of the room in that one, and... We really need anything else. I'll put a clock in here. I'll put that one on there, and I'll put a wicker chair down here. Uh, and we can go there, can tuck into the corner. And you know what? We will go for making the room a little bit more prestigious. There, level three. Just like that. There is our DNA room. We'll put some benches outside. Oops. Move you along a little bit. There. Okay. Benches are outside. And then I want to go to higher. Do I need any more nurses for a minute? Doctor. Well, I'll take ace tension. I will take you. you got a weak bladder. I was considering having you as a second psychiatrist, but I'm not going to now. I'm just going to have you like this. And I'm going to train you in the running of the DNA lab over here as soon as I've got this up and running. So the DNA lab, I think, is a one-off. So it's actually a treatment thing. We need treatment, and then we need um, doctors here. We need treatment, and then the DNA lab thing 
beside it. That's that's kind of what we want to do. So you're gonna you're gonna have the DNA lab training. That's what I'm gonna give to you. So you're not gonna go and work in the GP office. Uh, you, Milo, should not be allowed to work in the GP office either. And but you can work in the others. And then this dude here is currently not gonna be allowed to work anywhere. Because I want him only working in the DNA lab. That is going to be his sole place of employment. As soon as this one here is done, I've got 13, 16 days. We can upgrade the Helixer. So we'll do that immediately. 15,000 to upgrade that one. And then as soon as that is done, restart that one. I don't think it's ever going to get done. Health inspection. Henry Jobsworth is going to be inspecting. Yada, 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 yada. Hospital is in debt. That's not very good. Staff challenge. Hospital attractiveness of 70%. We failed. Yeah, I kind of forgot all about it, to be honest. Um, earning the 100,000 is something we can do. Toilets need routine servicing. Diagnostics 2 has been learned. I got another Diagnostics 2 is about to be learned as well. That Training is now complete. done. Class dismissed. Right, I need a bit of cash. I've got two patients remaining. I think actually both of them are going to be over there and... Uh, well, one of them is over there, False Tan. I think he's going to die before we actually get the training done. That's, that's not very helpful. Where's the other patient? Where is the other patient? Have I got two patients waiting over here? One. It's just you. Where is the other there? Trimidity, you're going to psychiatry. Right. So I'm not going to get any more money for a minute. So what we'll do instead then is if I go back to the loans, I will take out the middle loan and repay that one. So it gives me 47,000 and then we will go on to here and trainees available. I've got a nurse and a doctor. You, well, the doctor, we've, we've got to do the doctor first. He's, he's the most important one on this and he needs to be trained in genetics. So trainer right there and the other one could be Dr. Victor Biscotti, but no, I don't want to train you. So we'll do that. That's 10 grand. We'll start that training course in there. Oh, How long is that one? Now arriving at the 24 hospital. days. That's pretty good. Right, so 24 days, I got a feeling that this poor person here is not going to survive long enough. I got, I got, I got a strong, sneaky suspicion that they're not going to survive long enough to be able to do it. And that treatment over there has failed. Oh, it's not very warning. good. That isn't your medication. I mean, I do have a, a cure rate of 73% on there, but I haven't had a... Um, 10 streak yet, have I? I haven't cured 10 in a row, I don't believe. You, your health is deteriorating. You know what? This person here, we're going to have to send him home. Maintenance announcement. Plants need water. No, actually, I'm not going to. Right, what's wrong with you? Why are you looking so miserable? Needs a toilet, thirsty, unhappy, lazy, grumpy. Um... If you, I, sp I suppose they're, well, they're, they're returning, to, you know, don't return to work. Go, go and, go and have yourself a break, man. Go, go and have yourself a break. You, you, you've earned it. You deserve it. The staff room's possibly a little bit small. Maybe that's what they're struggling with. I know what I can do. When I got my assistant sat down here, and they're, they're kind of like waiting, and they, they, you could do the break. Tempted to just send him on a break right now. I'm not going to. I'm not going to send him on a break yet. Course training. All right. Cor cor genetics course is complete. How long have you got before you keel over and die? This is going to be cutting it pretty fine. Where are you going? Queuing. Spending a tenner there. Here comes the doctor. Go. Go in. Go in. Go on. Get called in. Yes. Yes, as soon as they, they don't die once they reach the room. So now it's all dependent on whether this doctor with his new round of um, training is, is able to do this. It's, it's all down to him. You utter moron. 
I gave you all the training that you could possibly have wanted and you couldn't do it. You absolute blithering idiot. You failed. Wave 6 is starting. We have got 35 patients coming in. Inspection report. Nothing happy. Nothing good, but nothing bad. That's not really what you want to hear, is it? Right. I hope y'all ready for this, people. I hope y'all ready for this. Earn 100,000. We failed on that one as well. I'm not doing very well with these tough challenges, am I? That's all right. That's all right. We, we don't mind that. We'll be right back. 32,000 on there. Doctors are lined up, ready and raring. This is good. Uh, I want to do a training course. So I've got junior assi my assistant. I don't really want him doing anything at the minute. i got a student nurse over here, or I've got this doctor. I could train you so you can go and help in the ward a little bit better. That might be a good idea. And I also want to get him in level 3 psychiatry. Now, I've either got to start level 3 psychiatry training right now. So that by the time the patients are processed, I think that would be a better idea. That's what we're going to do. We're going to go into the loans in here. And I'm now loan exempt on that one. That's just great, isn't it? And I just lost a whole load of money on there as well. Literally just missed out on that by seconds. So we won't do that then. We will train you instead. Uh, we'll take courses available. That is going to be ward management, trainers. I'll take that nurse there to do the training. You can do the training rather than the level 3 one. The level 3 one would be better off working in the ward. So we'll do it like that. And we'll do him a bit later. So yeah, I, I went and got the money. I went and took out that loan. At immediately the same time as we had money go through on here. And I did have a big loan I could have gotten here. But now our hospital is reduced in value. Just a little tiny bit. They're running through. They're processing through very quickly here. Our janitors are high... Not janitors. Our assistants are highly efficient. We're down to minus 9,000. That's looking good. Hermitism. That is ward. Obsessive fondness for beach towels. Right. That is someone going into the ward for treatment for that one. We've got our ward management training over here. So that we're going to have two people working on the ward. Money is getting a bit low. We're, we're, well, it's coming. It's, it's heading in the right direction now. Definitely heading in the right direction. Let's restart that because we. This is this is where we make our money. We get all these people coming in. This is where we can start to make our money. I mean, uh, yes, I do have a whole load of staff who are sucking us dry right now, but um, we should be we should be alright. We can still work through this. We can still work through this. Ten ten new levels. It's been a fantastic day of organic theatre here at the Sloop. Join us for day two, or is it game two, tomorrow on Two Point Radio. If we're lucky, we'll be another day closer to a result in this year's Grand Point Final. In this year's Grand Point Final. Right. Junior assistant. I've still only got one assistant who is ready for more training. I'd like to have two assistants that are ready for more training. I'm minus 3,000 now. I got my doctors lined up. They got five or six people on each. And I've got staff challenge. Could we cure some patients? That would Janitor, be like really cool. To repair drug mixer. Yeah, we'll give that a go. We'll try curing some patients just for something different, you know. Try something new and unusual. But what I want is enough money to be able to train psychiatry level three. That's what I really want. If I put him in. Well, I think that's quite enough care and loving attention inflicted upon the patients from myself for today. So we will return next time. In the meantime, if you have enjoyed this episode, then could you please head down below and give us a like. And if you really enjoyed it, then please tell your friends all about me. Get them to come and watch as well. That would be awesome. And until next time, thank you very much for watching. This is Frithgar. Goodbye and see you later.